so strong this night. Welcome, wherever you are. Hallelujah. Giving praise, giving praise, giving worship. Hallelujah. Welcome tonight, everybody. Giving praise tonight. Praise him, welcome. <clears throat> this wall of Jericho must fall. This wall of Jericho must fall. Welcome tonight. And God will change, break protocols for your sake. Welcome everybody tonight, Goretti, Napoleon, Ice. How are you, Charity James? Welcome, Dora Kumi. Stop praising him. Favor is your name. God will break protocols all for your sake. When the wall of Jericho falls, protocol is being broken. Praise him tonight. Thank him tonight. Worship him tonight for the gift of life, for the grace of God, for the mercy of God. So you say to yourself and, and for the devil to hear that every Jericho wall will come down. Every Jericho wall will come down in the name of Jesus. Every Jericho wall is coming back. Keep praising him. For the gift of life for this seven day program that starts tonight in seven days it's seven days hallelujah say lord i know every wall of jericho is coming down loud Say with all your might. See, you wall of Jericho, you are coming down. You are coming down. Keep saying it. You are coming down. 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 Every wall of Jericho around me is coming down. Thank the Lord. Worship Him and declare it in advance right now. Hallelujah. Praise Him. Exalt him. We alamo shalaba kasiyaraba. Praise him now. Give him praise. Give him praise. Give him praise. Hallelujah. Jesus of Anthony, welcome. Solomon Kwaku, welcome. Monica Harry, Henry, Bidemi, Iluromi, praise God tonight. Jacob Musa, Sammy Jose, Chetty Choba Chetty. Hi, South Africa. Praise Him tonight. Worship Him tonight. Yila Baba Kashaka Bagus Enkede. Rigana Bagas Enkala Bakasakaba. Raka Masatayada. Rigoro Mayada. Yala Masoto Yamahaya. Gayandana Bakushani Abasa. If angels can praise the Lord, why can't I praise the Lord? Oh, 
Hallow be your name. Hallow be your name. Praise him because your wall of Jericho, every wall, every barrier, we fall. Thank him in advance and declare every wall of Jericho will fall in the name of Jesus right now. Hallelujah. Loud, loud, loud. Baba. 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 Oh. Baba, you are worthy, Baba. Praise Him wherever you are. Be all the glory. Be all the honor. Be all the glory. Be all the honor. Be all the glory. Praise Him, praise Him. I believe God these seven days, every wall of Jericho is coming down. Keep declaring it. And your story is changing. God is giving you victory. And there will be the shout of victory. Hallelujah. My story has changed. He has given me victory. Amen. Saving me on the cross. That is why no one can stop you. The cross is not in vain. They cannot stop me. Say it loud. They can't stop me because of the cross. The cross is not in vain. No one can stop me. No one can stop my destiny. No one can stop my prayers. No one can stop my answers. No one can hinder me. Yala Baba Bak. Zeno favor, welcome. Sarah, welcome. Juma Peters, welcome. I have a God who never fails. You have a God though who will never fail you. He will never fail. Forevermore. He will never allow you to end in shame. Oh, give him praise tonight and say, Lord, Yeni Mako Sianabak, Rege Bosoto Logo Bobos Ekiatara Vayadaraba, Madela, Madela Bosate, Ingo Lobo Goshek, commit these seven days to God and say, Lord, reach us in a new way. Reach us in a new way, oh God. Commit tonight, tomorrow, next to the seventh, eighth day. Lord, reach me again. Holy Ghost, speak again. Holy Ghost, raise me over the wall. My made God, 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 my made God. I will never worship man-made God. This God is too faithful to fail. In few minutes, I will show you why. Say, Lord, you are too faithful to fail. Tell him. And because of his faithfulness, Jericho, that barrier will come down. Give him praise tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This, this new week this last week of February we give him praise we are entering the last week of February today is uh, 19 yes immortal God how great you are immortal God invisible God immortal God 
How faithful you are. <laughs> my papa, oh. Now my papa, oh. Oh, now my papa, oh. One more time, everybody. God of miracle, miracle, my papa. Oh. Once we are folded and above, I'll start. God will answer you tonight, tomorrow, Wednesday, Thursday. Don't miss this series this week. God is. Kem Kem, Grace Ode, Grace Aruna, welcome everybody, Ruth, Fulashade, Margaret Singwa, hallelujah, we are over 500 now, and I, those of you online, would you please just invite somebody quickly, don't waste time to share and to invite somebody, those of you here for the first time, welcome you, and I want to just say to me, we try to make it brief, today's the introduction of the world of Jericho must come down, we are going to talk about Lord, change the rules for my sake. And I, I believe even the world coming back, the world coming down, that story, that story of the world coming down, God had to suspend the law of nature. God had to break protocols. God had to break it. Say, Lord, break every protocol for my sake. Change the rule for my sake. Oh God, this as February comes to an end, oh God, change the rule for my sake. Let the words come down. Father, change scientific rules, military rules. Because what, what we are about to hear does not make military sense. Does not make any scientific sense. God will change the rule for your sake. And the world will come down. Can I hear a very big amen? Okay, now. Another miracle coming on my way. How about you? Let me read from you this morning, tonight, afternoon, wherever you are on the globe. Let me read for you Joshua just, just chapter 6. It says, and Jericho was all shut up, or shut up because okay, because of the children of Israel. None went out and none came in. Josh 6. Now the Lord said unto Joshua, See, see, I have given the, into the hand Jericho. I came this night and this week to prophesy. Whatever God told Joshua, I have given you. Humanly speaking, it didn't look like you will have it. But I've given you everything about this. Yeah, he, he would say, but Lord, it, I'm, it's so scary. The wall was as big as the room where I am now. Forget about, about the walls of China. The wall of Jericho was as big as about 14 feet. Yes. Or where I am, it's almost 50, 50 to 70 feet. Forget that. I have given you healing. I've given you husband. I've given you long life. I've given you prosperity. I've given you favor. I've given you result from insult. I've given you, you know, signs and wonders. I've given you speed. I've given you mercy. I've given you rising without falling. I've given you mercy. Uh, 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 let me just call it quickly. I've given you all my faithfulness. I've given you angelic mysteries and visitation. I've given you goodness. I've given you whatever man cannot give to you. And then Joshua was wondering, Jericho, how can, is that possible? Lord, you know how, how we are? No army, nothing. Jericho was a fortified city. The popular city of the moon. It's called the city of the moon. It's called the city of the palms. Jericho was full of treasures. Jericho was rich. Jericho was, 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 you were, you'll be wondering, why was God interested in destroying the wall of Jericho? He said, God did not say, I will give you. Somebody tonight, lift your hands and declare, 
God has given me this. Mention something. God has given me this. Giving me that. Giving me this. Start it now. Come on. Mention it now. God has given me all that pertains to life and godliness. God has given me riches. God has given me favor, mercy. God has given me. God has given me. Always say it. Long life. God has given me. Good health. God has given me. He's not going to give you. He has given you. God does not call the things that be as though they are. The Bible says God called the things that be not as though they as though, as though they are. The things that be not. What your eyes can't see, what you what you can't see, the, everything is negative to what you are seeing. But don't ever confess or declare what you are seeing. God, Romans 4 17. He said he's he said he's the God that called the things that be not as though they are. Abraham was childless, and he said, You are no more Abraham, you are Abraham. You know, God speaks in advance. I want this week and this night to speak in advance. Come on, go ahead now. God has given me this. What is your cry? What is your desire? Say it loud where you are. Come on, speak like your father. You say, God called the things that be not. They don't exist physically. They don't, they, they don't look possible to your eyes or your brain. But, you know, as if they are not as... You know, he, the, the, the things that be not. You are no more Sarah. Sarai, you are Sarah. Oh, Sarah. Meaning what? Mother. But, <laughs> and she laughed. What will make you surprised? What if your brain cannot carry? God will do it tonight and this weekend. And as this February is ending, and in March, April, May, June, July, to December, God will shock you. God will surprise your career. God will surprise your business. God will surprise your marital story. God will surprise you financially. In Jesus' mighty name. I've given you. It is didn't say I will give you. I have given you. Oh. So declared Lord. He has given me. 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 He has given me favor. Immigration favor. Visa favors. He has given me. He has given me growth in business. He has given me growth in career. He has given me healing and good health. Money is coming my way. Money is coming. Men are coming. Help us are coming. God has given me. Help us are coming. Help us are coming. He has taken away insult. Joshua, sir, I have given you. He will look. <laughs> this wall you have given me. See my hand. One, two, three, four, five. Five fingers. Those who are carrying machine guns. They are carrying, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know. They are carrying ballistic missiles. Let me use the word because they, are, they have one of the best weaponry and the best army in their time. Okay, go on. See, and the king thereof have given that king, which means you overthrow, and the mighty men of valor. Because that's what they had. They were the best men in or fighters in the in those days. And God said, "I have given you. I hope you are sharing and blessing somebody today. Hope you are sharing and blessing some." somebody today share right now and bless somebody because god has given to that person yes what belongs to them satan is a liar he must lose what god has given you this week and every every barrier to what god has given me will fall every barrier to what god has given you shall fall shall fall shall fall shall fall shall fall share now invite somebody let some be blessed. don't just look at me let some be blessed Every wall of Jericho before Jericho. Why Jericho? Because Jericho, after you, after Moses died, he told Joshua, he said, "You will lead the disciples to the promised land." Now, out there, after that, they crossed Jordan. Jordan, after, after burying Moses, they crossed Jordan, and Jordan was the river, and they crossed Jordan at at a very in auspicious time. It was a time when human beings should not go near the river. When Jordan overflew, overflowed its banks, time of hurricanes and you know, uh, you know, 
Tsunamis. God said that's where you will enter. Somebody you will win. They cross Jordan at its most dangerous season. You will cross. You will overcome the dangers of this earth. The dangers of every covenant. The dangers. The most difficult season. See, I always say this to you. A lion cannot be hungry in the forest. You, I don't care how the country where you are is. But you can't be hungry. God will make a way where there seem to be no way. Can I hear amen? He said, I have given you. Watch this. Ayesha compass the city of all men with all, and of war and go about the city once. You, you all know the story. Thus shall it you shall do for six days. And seven priests and all that, you know the story and seven ram horns you know trumpets they will blow the trumpet and will carry the ark of the covenant to go the ark means the presence of god for the wall of jericho to fall please i want to play with you this morning or this afternoon this, this night always go with the ark one go with the ark let the wall come down the ark represents the presence of jehovah the ark of the law the shekinah glory of god was always around the ark so for the for for your wall to fall, for the barriers to come down. And by the way, I hope you all know that we all, we all have wars. We live in the in a world of wars. You have wars of insult, wars of fear, wars of of sin, wars of stagnation, wars of sicknesses and diseases, wars of shame. You know, things fear of the future is a war. It's a barrier. Wars of marital delays. Wars of yokes. Wars of hatred. Wars of enemies. Wars of envy. We, we have wars. That are, is, we, we live in a world of wars. The whole earth is full of wars. From the morning you wake up in the morning to night, it's wars. Wars and wars. I command this night every barrier to your destiny any wall blocking you from your promised land this wall must come down this night and these seven days in the name of jesus in the name of jesus in the name of jesus we are living in a world of wars wars everywhere i want to stop you every day wars of scandals wars of those that hate you for no reason. Wars of occultic powers. Wars. Barriers. Of gossips. Of envious people. Those that pray against you. Wars. And he said to him. He said, and I, and it shall come to pass, and all that. Let me just jump quickly. Let's start again from verse 15. Okay, let, I, will, I, will, I, will, I will be on, on verse on chapter uh, verse 20 quickly. And the people so the people shouted when the priests blew with the trumpet and it came to pass when the people heard the sound of the trumpet and the people shouted with a great shout that the wall fell down the wall fell down and flat i like the word flat because i will explain the word flat to you see the word flat actually means we don't know how the wall came down. It was, it, it was not It's an external force that pushed it, not the shouting. It's time to shout. It's time, it's your week to shout. It's your week to shout. You have cried long enough. You have murmured long enough. But what the, the most important thing tonight, I'm just trying to summarize it. 
is this two things I want, I, want, I want to say why was God after the wall of Jericho he, he was after that wall because after Jordan the next barrier was Jericho Jericho was the, was the barrier to the promised land uh, if, they, if they, they were able to conquer Jordan they crossed it wow the river divided they crossed then now the next obstacle was Jericho humanly speaking impossible and I want to say this this week and this night what will stop you from your promised land is coming down what will stop you from your expectations is coming down after Jordan it was Jericho that was the next city unconquerable humanly speaking and God said no I shall take away every barrier every hindrance to your joy to your visitation to your glory to your peace to your dancing to your to your resort from insult every Jericho every Jericho standing on your way you must pass through it and you and you must go to where what I have spoken to Moses about which is the promised land God told Moses you cannot enter the promised land Joshua shall lead the people to the promised land but but Jericho is saying where are you going Jericho is that is that battle that is saying where are you going Jericho is saying you cannot pass Jericho is saying you will remain in the same place but I came this night prophesied every barrier is coming down Jericho is coming down the wall is coming down the wall is coming down that sickness war, that inferiority complex war, that battle war, any war blocking you, whatever is a hindrance, I command it to come down now. Jericho is coming down. Everybody have a Jericho. A Jericho is a barrier between you and your joy and your testimony. This night I prophesy, I don't know how God will do it. That's why the word flat was used. It fell flat and the Original Hebrew says, as if it was pushed by an external force. <laughs> I love that. As if it was pushed by an uh, external or sin force. It fell flat. You could have said it fell. Flat, it just came like that. So neat. The struggle is over. The struggle is over. So shout. The Lord will do it for me. My struggle is over. The Lord will do it for me. My struggle is over. God will do what I cannot do. My struggle is over. Lord, I trust you. Lord, I trust you for these people. Lord, I, for this week, oh God, the struggle is over. Lord, visit this woman and this man. The struggle is over. The barrier is over. The struggle is over. The struggle is over. The world fell flat. Then the next thing I will take the, the, for this first thing is about the path, if you want Jericho to come down, be silent. They move around six days like moogles, like fools, like idiots. No talking. For Jericho to come down, stop talking. No noise. Silence is a, is a weapon in God's hands. Just move around it. Once, then go to the camp. Second day, once go to the camp, their mouth go like this. Third day, once go to the camp. Fifth day, I can imagine the the Jericho people say, "This these Jews are fools, man. They are just <laughs> they are confused. This high wall, how will they climb it?" Silence is a weapon. I don't care so i see about 82 of you in the valley of silence where it looks like god is not talking it's a very important weapon when god puts it in the valley of silence looks like every other person they are making noise this is happening but in your life there's silence silence happened between the two creations before let there be light. Genesis 1 says, in the beginning was that, that, that God created the heavens and the earth. That in the beginning was the first creation. Before 
the, the, the devil rebelled. And the earth was without form and void. Oh, everywhere was confused. God, God didn't create the world like that. In the beginning was the first creation. And the earth did not have any shape. It was shapeless, void. That, that, that wasn't what God created. That wasn't how he, he created it. Because Lucifer rebelled, so they were pushed down, and with the water was all over the, the whole earth, and there was darkness. That was the first creation. Then God came and said one day, let there be light. That's the second creation. What I'm saying is this. So there was a period of silence before creation. The silence in your life now, if God doesn't seem to answer, if God is not, you know, as if God has gone on holiday, God has a plan. And you will come out of your silent season. For about nine years in my life, before I discovered our daily manner, it's like God was silent. I was crying, crying, God, where are you? Lord, help me, Lord, help me. Silence. Any woman was going through silence, you are faithful to God, but looks like nothing is happening, or he's slow, or he's, he's not speaking at all. I prophesy today, wait upon him. Silence means silent trust. You put your confidence in him. You are not afraid. You are not murmuring. You are not envying others. You are not comparing yourself with others. You are not saying, no, look at them. How about me? You are just quiet. People hurt you. You are just quiet. You are trusting God for your vengeance. You are trusting God. Silence. There are times I have gone to that point of silence. And I couldn't pray. I couldn't talk. Yes, yeah, silence. Silence is a weapon. Stop talking. When your life looks like something is wrong. God, where are you? God is silent. That's why God gave Zechariah silence. So that he doesn't de destroy the miracle. Yes, God was silent for many years. Who was Zechariah? Abraham, God was nothing was happening. Yes. How about Moses? For 40 years, God said, I will use this child. But for 40 years, God disappeared. God disappeared from the man's life. In quotes. I came today to prophesy. When God seems to have left you in the valley of silence, stay there. He has a plan. He has a plan. They move around Jericho once. Silence. He said, don't talk. You can imagine if a pin dropped, you will hear it. It was so quiet. But God is walking. God is walking. God is walking. When, when you are feeling discouraged, say to yourself tonight, I'm not discouraged. I'm not giving up. I'm not quitting. I wait upon the Lord till my change comes. The Bible says, Isaiah, in confidence and in quietness shall be your strength. It says in Psalm, it says, be still, be quiet, be still, be quiet. When you don't understand how your life is going, just say, Lord, I trust you anyhow. God, I trust you anyhow. God, I trust you anyhow. I'm not a quitter. Be still and know. Until you are still, you won't know. Be still. He said, march round Jericho. Father, I decree for this one week and the life of those who are watching, use the power, the weapon of silence that she is going through, that he is going through, Lord. Father, let there be a bulldozer. Father, use silence. Anybody in the valley of silence that think God has forgotten them, Lord, encourage them this week. I send encouragement. Somebody shout, I receive encouragement beyond human comprehension in the name of Jesus. Silence is a weapon. Silence is a weapon. Intolerable Salier, you are coming out. You are coming out. 
Jericho will come down. That barrier will come down. That yoke will come down. You are unstoppable. Whatever is standing between you and your promised land, it must come down. It must come down. Somebody shall praise the Lord. Whatever is standing between you and your promised land is Jericho. Come down, come down, come down, come down. Prophesy to Jericho and say, Come down, come down, come down. Any man, any woman, anything standing between you and your promised land is called Jericho. No, 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 Shabo. Ketia Lamaha. Ingelebo Sadebo. Kuyamala. Egeta Yada Makashelo. Ingolo Yadebo. I must get to my promised land. I will sit on my throne. So I declare it long tonight. I will get to my promised land. And I will possess my possessions. Shall praise the Lord. I will not stop. Even when things are silent, I will continue to march around. Joshua, what is going on? Say, he said, I don't know myself. Just march, no talking. Look forward. Fourth day, the max round. Fifth day, the max round. Sixth day, the max round. Silence. I'm sure in the temple, in the various accommod, they will look at themselves. What are we really doing? Isn't this stupid? They say, look, it's stupid. I think very stupid. Please keep sharing, keep sharing, keep sharing, keep sharing. And God bless you as you share. Keep sharing, keep sharing, keep sharing right now. Keep sharing right now. Keep sharing. Those on YouTube, just click subscribe and, in, and the bell and, 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 and hit the bell. Those on on on, face, on Facebook, just click the follow, the like and the share. Sharing is so important to me and to your God. Let somebody get blessed. Click the follow if you're on Facebook. Click the like and click the share. If you are on um, YouTube, click the bell and click the subscribe. Then click share. Do it now. Do it now. What are we really doing? We don't know. The ways of God are not the ways of man. Joshua, just obey. Yes, sir. And I speak to that woman online this night. Just wait. 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 That man, just hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I speak to that family. Hold on. I see God moving. I see the face of silence. It will soon be over. God will soon move you to the face of shouting. And from tomorrow and next tomorrow, you'll be hearing more about the shouting. And who pushed down the wall? The Yanama Sata. Egi Yanabaka. Then on the seventh day, the march round seven times, repeated the process, and they shouted. It was a loud shout. And they came, the, the wall came down. So I speak to somebody tonight. Shout at every battle. The shouting season, God will take you there to your shouting season. There's the time to be silent. So if you are silent now, don't worry. But keep shouting this night and say, Jericho, I command you to come down. Come down. Don't beg Jericho. Shout at it. Don't beg any barrier, any hindrance, any witch, any wizard, any occultic power. Say, I command you, come down, come down. Come down, come down, come down, come down. And I speak to them to come down right now. Everybody in your destiny, your life, let them come down in Jesus' name right now. Everybody, oh God, to this man, this woman, this girl, this boy, this family, Father, that is between them and their promised lands. Oh God, I decree, let this woman possess a possession. Let this man possess his possession. This is my cry, your family. Possess your possessions. Somebody declared. Hope you are praying. 
Hope you are praying. Yeliamos Ange. In Kalama Sandiara. Rogo Mayade Shalamaze. In Yolobaga and Kiyabada. That world shall catch fire. That world shall burn. That world shall come down. The angels pushed it down. You, you will know it is not, not, not God. Not man. That this is God. I came this night to prophesy to you in the name of Jesus the miracle of this is God. This can only be God. Shall be your portion. The miracle of this can only be God. This can only be God. This can only be God. This cannot be, be a man. This can only be God. This style, this strategy can only be God. Yin Talamasha, say I receive this night. The miracle of this can only be God. Take it this week. Take it this week. Take it this week. That barrier is breaking now. Immigration barrier is breaking now. The yoke of visas are breaking now. Your academics is is the yoke of your academic your your, your children whatever is breaking now. The yoke of favor is breaking now. Day of no favor is breaking now. Lema kosiyama, regi magosh atiyanaba, regi amodo. Say it loud this night. The miracle of this can only be God. The way the world fair flats. This can only be God. This can only be God. This can only be God. They shouted. Please keep shouting. Don't murmur. Keep shouting. I'm a billionaire. I'm a millionaire. I am well. I am healed. I am delivered. I'm, I'm strong. I am great. I am rich. I'm prosperous. I'm highly favored. Shout! 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 Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Give him praise tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Give him praise tonight. Give him praise tonight. This is day one. Tomorrow is day two. And we'll be sharing about the two at 8 p.m. tomorrow. And uh, don't ever forget, there'll be more announcements tomorrow. But if you have a testimony, we can take one or two this night. Yeah, those numbers, just tell them I have a testimony. I want to give the Lord praise for that. Please, just keep shouting. Shout tonight. Prophesy. Shout, shout. There's a period to be quiet. Till everything looks silent. Yes. What happened in the 40 years that Moses, 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 was missing in action? And God so before God can use you sometimes, he will pass you through a phase of silence. That is the emphasis tonight. And the phase of shouting will come. And the wall of Jericho will come down. Everybody has a Jericho. And everybody has a wall. I name them. If you feel anything complex, it's a wall. When you envy others, that's a wall. Envy. Don't forget it. Envy is a war. Sickness is a war. Disappointment at the edge of your breakthrough is a war. You see yourself in the dream eating and all that, and all this issue of uh, once you are pregnant and you have a red blood, you dream of red, it goes. I command the yoke, I curse it this night. I lose pregnancies this week. Fruit of the womb. Miracles. Delay is a word. But sometimes that's what you call delay. is God's face of silence. 
March round Jericho, don't talk. So don't think where you are is a final bus stop. You God will take it to the to the valley of shouting, to the mountain of victory. The mountain of shouting. God will take you there. The mountain of shouting. You will shout, but still where you are, be faithful to God, be still and know. Stop worrying. God has a plan. When someone asked me last week, when Bishop, I've been waiting for God now. When so it was a marital question. Where we got pray right now. Every wall of Jericho, monetarily come down. Break, break. Every wall of Jericho, financially come down now. Come down now. Come down now. Wall of Jericho, in terms of my health, come down now. Come down now. Wall of Jericho concerning my business, come down now. You know, concerning my career, come down now. About immigration, every wall of Jericho to my immigration issues and my desires. I said, come down now, visas, come down now. Wall of Jericho to my progress, come down now. Wall of Jericho to my joy, come down now. Wall of Jericho, come down, come down, come down. I will march over you. You will see more tomorrow how they enter to the, into, into, into the city. And, and you know, God was so grateful. God, God, I mean, we, they, they were so grateful. Except Rahab. We talk about Rahab. Rahab was saved. Only the portion of Rahab did not fall. God has a plan. Don't cry. God has a plan. Before the whole world was pushed down, and there were angels waiting at that wall at Rahab's corner. I, I call it Rahab's joint. Rahab's corner was not broken. Think about that. Rahab's corner of the world was not broken. Somebody hear me today. God will spare you. God will make you. God will exempt you. God will exempt you. Someone say this night, this week, this month, this year is my week of exemption. God will exempt me. This month is my month of exemption. This year is my year of exemption. Rahab, where are you? So we are here. How about, how about your dad? Is is here? Your mom is here. Everybody, God exempted Rahab. God changed the rule for Rahab. One of Jericho came down, but Rahab's corner, Rahab's joints, did come down, and that's what will happen. The enemy will come down. God will bypass a million of them and keep you. Say, Lord, give me the mark of exemption. She tied, you know, what I want to call uh, the, the silk. The red on, on, on her wall. And when, 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 the angel saw it, when the angel of death saw it, the angel of death saw it, they passed over her. Your wall is coming down. The Jericho is coming down. And God will give you a mark of exemption. Say, oh God, this week, give me a mark of exemption. Somebody pray it now. This week, every day, say it. I carry the mark of exemption. A thousand shall fall by my side. And ten thousand by my right hand. If you don't come near me, praise him tonight. I carry on my spirit, soul, and body marks of exemptions. The Rahab anointing is on me. I'm unstoppable. Delay is not denier. Regabosa, she came out rejoicing. Somebody hear me tonight. The, the, the miracle of this can only be God. We be your portion. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. No, 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 no. Take it, no, 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 no. Take it now. Take it now. 
take it now. Father, do a thing. That we make the world to say, this can only be God. Take it now. Be still and know I am God. Move around. Be patient. That world will come down. I love you. I appreciate you. If you are late tonight, as you are late, go to page. Our daily banner page 20, 20. Our daily banner page 29. And you'll give your offerings. Okay? Hallelujah. Praise God. So, I want you to know, be still, be silent, move around the world six times, keep quiet. So, delays or denier, you will testify. In quietness and in confidence shall be your strength. Don't forget, Moses was out for nine years, silent. Moses, 40 years. Every great man, Abraham was about 25 years, silent. God was like on holidays. Keep moving around that wall. It will come down. Because we are about to move to the phase of shouting. Your shouting season is very near. I'll see you tomorrow night. Give your offerings. Father, remind them to sow as they are led. In Jesus' name. Do your transfers this night. And pray that prayer. God, there's a mark of exemption on me. After the order of Rahab. Come on. Pray that as I sign off. Pray it very well and bless Monday, Tuesday, prophesy, shout to Wednesday, shout to Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, shout, prophesy, favor, mercy, grace, protection, preservation. And read your Bible every day, our daily manner. Every day, every day. Don't rush, don't rush. In quietness and confidence, this should be the first thing in the morning and give out copies. I love you. Do your best to forgive and let go and let God. Okay? Just worship Him right now. Praise Him. Praise Him. Praise Him. Praise Him. Praise Him for answer prayers tonight. Praise Him for answer prayers tonight. Praise Him for answer prayers tonight. Hallelujah. Praise Him for answer prayers tonight. Praise him tonight. Give the testimonies. Maybe tomorrow I will just open the line for the testimonies. I have opened it tonight. Thank you for answer prayers tonight. Worship him. Give him praise. Worship him. Worship him. Worship him. Hallelujah. Say, Lord, thank you for answer prayers. This week is my week. I have on me. The mark of exemption in Jesus' name. Loud, loud, say it loud, say it loud, say it loud. So I will never rush ahead of God. The wilderness season, the quietness of God. See, time to mold you. It's molding you, preparing you for something great ahead. 
we call it the the silence season or the wilderness season. Tonight I've spoken on silence. Tomorrow I will take one of Jericho from, from another angle. Get up early and pray. Thank you for answer prayers tonight. Come on. Everybody, good night. I love you. I appreciate you. Keep praying now. Good night, everybody. See you tomorrow, 8 p.m.